Okay, so everybody wants a boost gauge in their car. Everybody wants to know what the hell's going on with the ECU, whether it's your air fuel ratio or your oil temperature. Um, so everyone results in gauges. And, you know, gauges are quite cool. They're fucking sick. But they're expensive. They're a pain in the ass to set up depending on what you actually want to put in your car. So, today I found a little bit of a cheap way to do it. Um, it's definitely not as cool, but it will definitely help if you're just going on a uh, uh, spirited drive with the boys. Um, and you want to know how much boost you kick in, or if your oil temperature is okay, the new, with your new intercooler you just put in, you know, all that kind of stuff. Um, so, today, I will be showing you how to do it with a phone, an old phone. It can be Android or iOS. And an OBD2 Bluetooth dongle device thing. Now, the Bluetooth one is for the Android phone, but you can also get a Wi-Fi one for an iPhone, something that runs an iOS. So it's 50-50, you know, I had an old Android phone lying around, so I thought, you know, fuck it, why don't I just use that? Um, and we'll see how we go. Just gave her a nice polish. Look at that. Just a nice clean car. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> All right, so the first thing that I got, I got this from eBay for literally like $10 delivered. It is called an ELM327, I got the mini version. Um, it's like a Bluetooth interface that plugs straight into your OBD2 port into your computer. So for those who don't know what an OBD2 port is, it's basically a USB port, but for cars. But it's not a USB port, because it's like, 16 different little pins in there so you literally plug that into your car which I believe mine is like under the dash here which I will try and find soon plug that into your car and then the whole point is to Bluetooth this to my phone and download an app and it will start sending diagnostics to the phone like um, like a boost gauge and different temperature readings and so yeah we'll see if we can set that up okay so I found the OBD port to put the Bluetooth device in. It is literally just under the dash light there. And there's this pin up here, that black thing. So, let me just reposition this camera. Going to literally plug it in up here. Boom, see the lights are flashing. Once you've plugged your Bluetooth dongle into the OBD2 port, you just put, have to put your car on, you don't have to start your car, just put your car on, you know, before you start your car. Then you refresh your settings on your phone to find OBD2. Connect to that with the passcode 1234, simple as that. Once you're paired with that device, you're going to have to go into the App Store or the Play Store now for Android there is a free app and it's called Talk, okay? Um, it's called Talk Lite, you can get the pro version, it's $5, probably has a few more cool stuff. But today we're just going to go to the Lite version. Um, it literally looks like, uh, you probably can't see it, no, you, you, fucking, yeah, you can't see it. Um, it's literally just called Talk Lite OBD2 and Car by a guy called Ian Hawkins. All right, so we're gonna open that. Okay. Checking automatic search. So it is connected to the ECU. Oh, wow. As soon as you start it up, it literally just says starting, connected. All right, so I've just played around with the app a little bit. Um, so far, I've put, so you just go literally add, oh, hold on. <laughs> So you just go into the little add sign down there, this little one right here, and you can just 
add a display um, but for now I've added an engine RPM intake temperature boost gauge coolant temperature and the air fuel ratio trim so far um, now I've also got a big RPM gauge there so what we're going to do is we're going to test it out first so we're going to turn the car on Three, about 1,300 and we're on about 1,300 so pretty pretty cool right so we're actually in a vacuum right now so obviously if we coolant temperature should slightly rise as we heat up there we go we can see that coolant temperature rising very very cool so basically <clears throat> you could do a lot more with this app I haven't gone into detail with this but hopefully you can just follow this and you know fiddle around with it but it's pretty cool it's kind of like an electronic boost gauge and and all that kind of stuff so you can keep an eye on things and also a very cool thing about it is you can actually do some if you get like an engine code if you get like a check engine light you can plug this in and you can actually check it so you can see what it says so we can also act as one of those uh, diagnostics tools that you have to pay like 150 bucks from Buddy, um, super cheap auto for so you can literally do it for about fifteen dollars ten dollars yep so basically plug it in plug and play mate so um, yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll uh, see you next time